Hello, my name is Matthew Harrison. I'm a lecturer and researcher at the Melbourne Graduate School of Education in Learning Intervention. So my area of specialisation and passion is autism research and inclusive education, and how we can use technology to make inclusive education possible. Learning intervention is about making sure that every kid gets what they need to thrive. This includes, as teachers, having the knowledge and skills to be able to support these students and to make sure that they get what they need to be their best. Autism is a group of neurological conditions that result in differences in social communication and interaction, in intense interests or repaired patterns of behaviour, and often in sensory perception. In Australia, there are approximately 175,000 people with a formal diagnosis, but as our understanding of autism improves, we expect this number to increase. So the first step in supporting all autistic students is to listen to them and to find out what are the barriers that are stopping them from being safe, happy and learning. And to do this, we need to use their interests. We really need a strength-based approach. Autism is a wide spectrum. It can manifest in some different areas of strength and difference. So getting to know individual students is really important. One way we can support autistic gamers and learners is through the use of using cooperative video games. These are games where kids have to work together as a team, working towards a common goal. We can actually film these kids playing together and then play back positive examples of them using social skills we want them to focus on and, and further develop. We can actually research cooperative gameplay by filming kids working together and playing together and analysing this video, see how we can actually improve the methods of teaching we're using, the actual social skills we're focusing on and the design of the games themselves. It's a very exciting area. Another tool we can use is video modelling. Video modelling involves filming short segments of footage of a kid performing steps in a skill they're putting these short videos together to make a longer video showing the kid performing the entire skill. This way the kid can watch the skill being performed over and over again and it helps them to learn the steps involved. The social skills are really important for everyone to understand. This is a way that we communicate and interact with each other. So for autistic kids, they need to understand how to operate in a neurotypical normed world but also for our kids who are neurotypical, they need to understand the differences of autism. So it's really about understanding each other. If I had to summarize my research in a tweet, I would say it's all about creating the conditions for collaboration, but also optimizing the systems of intervention or learning how best to teach social skills to all kids.